What is up? Mikey here, and it is Wacky Wednesday. And this week, I am opening up some Sun and Moon Japanese booster packs. I also have some Dollar Tree Guardians Rising booster packs. And I have a ton of Breakpoint booster packs that are from the Dollar Tree. <laughs> also, I have... We're going to take a little PSA and show you guys some fake cards that um, are from the Sun and Moon set. And I will show you guys the difference between these guys' Sun and Moon set and these guys' Sun and Moon set. These are fake, so don't... They're fake. All right, so let's get going. I'm going to open up the Dollar Tree packs first, starting off with the these guys. We're just going to go and just have it be a hot mess. So how's everybody doing? Right now, it's freezing cold in Ohio. Like, I don't understand. It is so crazy. Oh, we got a Pokemon catcher. Um, it is way too cold. Tomorrow is supposed to be, like, Wednesday. Today. So, you're watching this today. It is supposed to be outside negative uh, five. That is ridiculous. Negative five. Oh, my gosh. I am not looking forward to tom for tomorrow. Ugh. Please. Let them cancel work. <laughs> yep. No work for me. Don't. Not coming into work. But anyway. So, yeah. I am super stoked to be opening up these cards. I have. Oh, by the way. If you guys want to check out Prof Mikey after this video, you're going to see me open up this ultra shiny booster box. Um, it has all the shiny Pokemons in it. All the shinies. So I'm super excited. I will hopefully get some Evolution shiny Pokemon. Please, please, please. But um, yeah, we're going to try and get this uh, opened on the Prof Mikey channel right after this video. Check it out. What's going on? I'm going to put you to the to the bottom. I'm going to open up these Sun and Moon uh, Guardians Rising packs last. Because I might get a Tapu Lele. If I get a Tapu Lele, I will be so happy. Because it came out of Dollar Tree Pack. But, most likely, I won't get anything. Because when you go to Dollar Tree, I'm pretty sure people weigh packs at Dollar Tree. So, but it's okay. I did it for you guys. Because I know you guys like to watch Dollar Tree Packs be open. I don't know why. I know a lot of people tell me they get hits from these Dollar Tree Packs. But I don't see a lot of them. I'm like, mm, nope. Let's see, let's see. I'm getting some rares, just some regular rares. I got a Conflable right there. Let's see. Electabuzz, that is not a rare. I did get a Pokemon Catcher right there. So that's pretty neat. But yeah, ooh, we got an Aegislash. And you go right there. But how's everybody going? I'm doing pretty well. I've been streaming. I'm loving streaming. Streaming is really fun. Um, and you guys, a lot of you guys have come into the stream to support. And I really appreciate it. You guys are super awesome. Thank you so much. Also, if you guys didn't notice, I have my little special EV play mat here. With all the people who's uh, come up to see me. Anyone who comes and see me at a tournament. If, they, if I have my play mat on me, I will let you guys sign my play mat. This playmat's a little bit full. I have another EV playmat that uh, one of the fans gave to me at uh, Philadelphia Regionals, which was really, really awesome of you. So I do, I, I forgot your name, but thank you so much. Really appreciate it. But yeah. So now I have more room for people to sign. I'm going to Australia in two weeks. So I'm super excited about that. I will be judging the Oceania Internationals uh, Championship. So it's going to be great. It's going to be great. I'm going to be doing a meet and greet on Sunday there too. So if you guys want to come up and visit, definitely meet and greet. We'll have um, someone announce it and everything like that. It'll be on Sunday. Set these to the side. I didn't get anything out of those packs. They were just garbage. Next one. It's going to be 
the Sun and Moon packs. We'll start off leaving these up here. Um, and then I'll open up these first. So yeah, this is a, these are random Japanese packs that, um, they were selling them at a flea market. And I told them they were fake and they were like, uh, really? And I'm like, yeah. And so I was like, if I have some, uh, Pokemon cards, I'll definitely show you guys how they're faking. You guys shouldn't be selling these. So we have a flying Pikachu, which is not in. As you can see, this is Evolutions and not Sun and Moon. Come on, focus. Focus on me. Focus. You see, it's Evolutions, and it doesn't have that, that hollow on there. Energy. And we have Sun and Moon, Sun and Moon, Sun and Moon, Sun and Moon, Lapras, and we have a Kingdra EX. Lapras and a Kingdra EX. Look at that. You guys can tell that they're obviously fake because they're not hollowed. Neither of these are hallowed. Woo! I'm up here yawning up a storm. Um, I'm going to show you guys the difference between a regular... Uh, this is a fake energy and a regular energy. Um, inside the card, you'll actually see that there is a black piece of paper that's wedged in between the two cards and that black little strip oh my god you're showing cards <laughs> i'm showing them the difference between a real it's that energy it's that energy. It's, that energy it's that energy it was special to me it was <laughs> it was special to me mikey <laughs> so on this uh fighting energy you can see that there's no black strip here and the texture of the card is actually just pure just pure garbage. Like you could, it just looks like it's cardboard. So, if you want to see if you have a fake uh, cards, and if you got them in a multiple set, and there is like a random common you don't care about or a energy, you can go ahead and take it. And if there is a black strip in there, that is one of the signs that you have real cards. If you don't see it, then most likely, uh, well, I'm a hundred percent sure that your cards are fake. <laughs> so, little PSA there. Our hollow is a drowsy, and we have a Steelix EX. Even though there's no EXs in this set, they're all GXs. I got another Lapras, another Lapras. Lapras is apparently a good fake GX to have. The, the quality is not horrendous, like, you could tell by the font, though, that it's bad, but the picture and stuff. If it had some kind of hollow, I can see that really, like, confusing some kids. My champ from Evolution that's not in Sun and Moon. Apparently, I'm just getting Laprises. Laprises and Kingdra EXs. That is not good. Where's the originality at? Where, where's the diversity of my fake Pokemon cards? Like, really? It's supposed to be, there we go, we got a Ho-Oh EX, <laughs> and we got a Tauros, oh, and a Glaceon EX, which you are not allowed to exist. You're not allowed to exist. Sorry. Sorry, I had to do it. I cannot have a fake evolution be in existence. Can't do it. Not allowing it. Sorry. It's just too much for me. Poliwhirl, a Lorantis, and a Mega Blaziken, and more energies. <laughs> that was an extra special pack. All right, now let's look and see what we have in these Japanese packs. We have nothing. <laughs> All right, next one. This is the sunset. All right, let's see. Ah, uh, nothing. We have a Lily Bay. Lily Bay. It's good. I'll take you out. Lily Bay. Lily Bay. Lily, Lily, Lily Bay. Ooh, nice. Nice. This is a. Wait. Oh! This is not Sun and Moon. I'm not saying Sun and Moon. This is Ultra Prism. Ultra Prism. Ultra Prism, because those aren't. <laughs> Rewind. Rewind back. I was like, why is Looker in this set? 
And these are, and now that I'm thinking about it, I'm like, this is Ultra Prism and not Sun and Moon. Sun and Moon base. Oh my gosh. Oh, I was like, why is Looker? Why is there a full art Looker here? <laughs> All right, so we got this gorgeous full art Looker, which I need a sleeve. Oh gosh. And then I throw it. Guess that's not a PSA 10 anymore. So please, everybody, quit. Don't, don't hate on me. Please, please, please. Because just feel bad for me. Because I only got one hit out of all the packs I opened today. Just feel bad for me. Don't don't hate on me. Please, please. I, I, I hurt you guys. I hurt you guys so much. There you go. I hurt you guys. Thank you so much. <laughs> well, on that note, um, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did... Make sure you give a subscription. Make sure you subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Hit a thumbs up and comment down below. Cause I will like to I like I love to interact and conversate with you guys. So let me know what you guys thought of the opening and make sure you go and check out Prof Mikey to see me open up this ultra shiny box. So you guys take it easy. Have a great rest of the day. I'll see you guys later. Bye.